What is up ladies and gentlemen, I am going to do a quick video on how to order prints from my website using the gallery software that I wrote. And I'm adding the voice after I did the video, so I'll do my best to keep this in sync. But um, what you see here is the normal gallery on any, any uh, photo shoot that I've published on my website. So you'll see something like this when you go to your gallery. And in order to order prints, what you're going to want to do is select the picture you want, and I like this one on the left, so I'll left click on it. And what's going to happen is going to open up what I call the carousel view. And this is a view that you can scroll through the pictures and see them bigger. And so when you select a picture, it's going to float like this. And if that's the one you want to print, you could left click on it. I think I'm going to do that eventually here. And it's going to open up this print view, and you're going to see all these print options here. Um, you can still use the left and right arrow key to change the image and when you, if that's the image you want in the thumbnail above then you have all these print options here and if you want more print options you can click more print options and it will add three more print options if you want something that I don't offer uh, send me an email I will add that to the list because I my goal is to to meet my customers demands and, and be you guys be able to order the exact prints that you want so I wanted an 8x10 of this, so when I click the 8x10 Add to Cart button, you're, it's going to take you to PayPal, and it's going to show you your shopping cart. Now, I already had a few things in my shopping cart from going through this process and making sure it worked. And uh, So if you wanted to change anything in your PayPal, you can see I have two of this 8x10 and two of the 5x7, and you have these Update and Remove buttons. Okay, so when you add your zip code here, and click calculate it's going to figure in the shipping and that's the shipping cost for me to order your prints from a professional photo lab and ship them to you so um, it's all those costs together and you can pay with the checkout process or via PayPal's secure website um, both those are great options they're secure uh, you shouldn't have anything to worry about these are really trusted websites um, if you decided you didn't want something you can click remove like I just did there and it's going to take that off. If you wanted to update the quantity, I think I update this to three and click update. Then uh, that's all you have to do, just like I did there, and the quantity is updated. And what this actually does when you place an order is it sends me an email, and it actually sends me the exact picture and a link to that image in a gallery. So I actually handle that myself. It sends me an email that says that you ordered these, these prints, and uh, I take care of that from my end. So I do it firsthand, so if there's ever any issues, you're, you're not dealing with an automated process, uh, I handle this as a person, and, and uh, you know, I'll, I'll take care of any issues that, that may come up, but um, it should be pretty simple. Alright, and so, that, this is the gallery page again, if you decide you don't want to buy any prints, or you, you know, want to switch back to the carousel view, you just click on the white part, and to get out of the carousel view, you click on the white part again and you can just look through the gallery like this. So I hope that helps you uh, with ordering prints from my website. If you have any questions, comments, um, just you can send me a, a message on my website or Facebook or email and I will get back to you and answer any questions you have and then I'll probably try to add them to this video to make sure that it's very clear. Thanks for watching. Bye.